fancy technology. <laughs> Hi, <laughs> I'm Amber, and this is my first poetry slam. <laughs> I'm really nervous to speak, and I'm proud of you who have spoken. No guts, no glory, but the glory is mine to hear your voices, your heart and soul that goes into your spoken word. I just turned 26, and I'm finally applying roots to the word love and straying from the ideations and boundaries that society has set. I was blessed to grow up in a home that was my mother and I, but I've always had conflicting ideas on love. Ten years ago, I loved in sync and mac and cheese, and the idea that love is between a man and a woman. I couldn't wait for my Prince Charming and his beautiful steed. Who knew I'd be, celebra who knew I'd be celebrating five years of love and friendship with my partner, Janet? <laughs> love is different, it has more meaning, it's deeper, and I didn't realize until tonight how deep love a family could be. My cousin wrote a poem for me, and I really like to share it. She told me tonight that you are the sun in the summer that makes me feel warm and fills me with joy. The moon in the night that shines so bright to let me know I'm not alone. You are the breeze on a summer day that hugs me when I'm feeling down. You're the rain that falls and washes away my worries. You are the quote that inspires me to keep moving forward. You are the song that explains my life to let me know I'm not the only one. You are the morning coffee that keeps me awake and gives me energy to go on with my day. You are the pillow I rest my head on when the world becomes too much. You are the great conversation that you have with a stranger in a small cafe. You are the northern star in the sky that leads me in the right direction. You are an angel that fell from the sky and into my life. And I'm blessed to have you in my life. I couldn't believe that she wrote those words to me tonight, and I really hope that each and every one of you has somebody that you can go home to at night, whether it's a sister or a brother, your mom or your dad. After the tragedy that happened yesterday, I want you to know that love is alive in every one of us, and everybody loves you. Everyone.